A video circulating on social media shows a man seriously injured after he was shot by an RCMP officer roughly 750 kilometers north of Winnipeg in Thompson, Manitoba. A warning to our viewers, the following story contains graphic images that may be disturbing to some. RCMP say on October 25th, around 2.45 p.m., a Thompson officer was on Princeton Drive to serve legal documents when the officer encountered a 30-year-old male who they say was armed with a knife. The video obtained by City News appears to show a 30-year-old man dressed in red walking towards the RCMP officer who is taking steps backward. A gunshot is heard. That's when the man slowly falls to the ground. City News is choosing not to show these images. This second video, provided to City News, recorded from a balcony nearby, shows what allegedly happens shortly after the officer discharged their weapon. Sandra Oman tells City News multiple police cars and officers arrived on the scene, attending to the male who was shot. I didn't know right away it was a gunshot. Oman says those living in her community want to know why the officer didn't use a taser on the victim and why it took so long for emergency crews to arrive. The ambulance could have made it quicker. City News reached out to RCMP for comment, but they would not provide a further update now that Manitoba's Independent Investigation Unit has been notified. MKO Grand Chief Garrison Sete says the shooting is concerning. The video that is circulating is extremely disturbing. On behalf of Manitoba, Kiwait, and Naoyoka Mackinac, I want to let the family and loved ones of this person know that our prayers and thoughts are with you at this time. My office has been in touch with the Thompson RCMP, and we are expecting a full report about what took place. In Winnipeg, Mark Newfeld, City News.